What's good? It's your favorite BBW back with another video. What's good, all my precious jewels? What's going on, everybody? I'm coming back to you with another workout video. As you guys can see right here, I'm on the treadmill, just getting them steps in, step, step, in, step, in, step, in. Not just playing. So. Right here, you know, I'm doing some um, cardio, but what we're doing is we stepping into it. You know, sometimes I speed it up, I slow it down. We got the incline going on. I only go to like 2.0, 2.1, 2.2 sometimes, you know, because I, I ain't lost that much weight, but we losing, so we, we get in here. But I'm going to try my best to drop y'all a video every day, even if it's only five or ten minutes, because today you won't believe it. The, I don't know if he's an owner, I don't know what he was, but they was having a meeting, and they was eating chicken, and I'm thinking to myself, like, what type of organization is this? Why y'all eating chicken while we sitting there working out? But anyways, they was having a meeting, like, in the front, right where everybody could see them, eating some type of chicken, and I'm on a machine, walking, thinking about hamburgers. And it was just crazy, but no, I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I won't think about hamburgers. But, yeah. So, anyways, they told me after they waited till I got done working out from 1030, okay, a.m. until 1 p.m. to tell me I can't bring my tripod and film for y'all. <clears throat> the, 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 the devil is a liar. But, anyways, I'm going to try to get some little... You know, seconds in for y'all, even if it's only two minutes here, three minutes here, four minutes here, one minute here. We're going to try to get it up there so we can get y'all at least a good quality video. Even if it's eight to 12 minutes, that's that's good enough. So, I was able to do here. I might just have to have my daughter hold the phone. But we're going to try to figure it out. We're going to keep dropping and we're going to do what we could do. You know, because I promise videos, even if I have to drop the days down to only three that's what we got to do. But I'm going to try to still get five minute, eight minute, or ten minute videos. I gotta, now I got to sneak a splat in the fitness on that bush. So I'm going to have to really get my machine working. So that way I could do maybe three days splat in the fitness, two days at home on my elliptical. Because they tripping, tripping. You know what I'm saying? I'm talking about they tripping, tripping. Ain't nobody going to sit here and not record. Man, I've been doing this since, I'm trying to tell y'all, literally. I've been doing this for over four months. I ain't stopping. And you ain't nobody gonna stop the grind. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? So that's what it was on the treadmill. I'm done with that. Oh, look at that big girl. Look at that big girl. Look at that big, 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 big girl. Ah! Okay, so right here we on the elliptical. The elliptical, as you guys know, and I mentioned it before, it helps the core. It helps inclines. It helps the heart. Because when that heart is pumping, that fur is going, that blood is moving, it helps your arms. You know how you got all that flabby, flabby for all my big girls or my heavier men? It helps, you know, burn some of that little fat off the arms because when you're going back and forth and back and forth and back and forth, you know what I'm saying? You sweat. So it's happy. it helps a lot of things, you know, and that's the beauty of the elliptical. It works on so much from the core to the sweating to just burning fat so you can actually put it on incline also like you could do a um, treadmill. And what incline is, is pretty much the machine starts to lift up off the ground. Once the machine starts to lift up off the ground, it goes into a format of like a hill. So it's like now you walking on a mountain. Or you can say a hill. Whatever you want to say that goes up with. But that's what you're doing. And when you're walking, you're thinking like, ooh, okay, I'm doing good. And that's very good for people who live on the Midwest. Like myself, I'm in Vegas. Because we live nothing but in mountains. So the pavements is not flat at all. It feels like you're walking on a mountain. So sometimes you might get out of breath if you have respiratory problems like myself. When I first moved here, hunty. When I tell you, I can walk for 10 seconds without, whoo, something ain't right, something ain't right. And my boyfriend thought I was crazy. My daughter, they thought I was crazy until they got on their bike about the next week. And guess what? <laughs> they were saying the same thing I was saying. Like, yo, you can really feel it. 
I could feel it because I had respiratory problems. Well, I had respiratory problems 10 times worse than what I got now. Now it's real, Matt. It's really light. But the reason why I had respiratory problems, because long story short, I had blood clots in my right lung, left lung, and in my right leg. That's going to be a story time one day. So I ain't going to get all up into that right now. I'm just going to sit here and do my fun voiceover for you people. Right here, right here, right here, right here. This is really just pretty much working on them arm muscles, working on that fat. You know what I'm saying? We're going up and down and up and down because what we're doing is we're working on muscles. We want to tone that fat arms. We want to tone them chunky arms up, you know? We want to get some of that fat to slam down. We want it to get it to look nice and, you know, firm instead of nice and flabby. That ain't what we want. If that's the case, we want to be going to the gym and doing this thing four times a week. That's what we won't be doing if we was, you know, want to keep it flat. But that ain't, that ain't what we do. So, that's what this is for. This is pretty much for them arms. That's great. You can actually lean back almost like if you land on a couch or a bed. Or you can sit up straight like I'm doing right here, right now. Look at my face. I was sweating. But you know what? That big girl was going. Look at that. Go, big girl. What you going to do? Girl, I was, ooh, look at me. These right here are battle ropes. Battle ropes is... 25 pounds. 25 pounds. With these battle ropes, you sweat. Your whole back sweat. I promise you, any rolls I have, this battle rope is going to help me get rid of the rolls. Okay? This rope seems easy because I make it look easy, but they're heavy. Right here, you got me and my daughter. And what we, I have a 30 pound uh, weight. Now, look at her little bit of weight over there. She got. None other than a five pound weight. Boy, I tell you, kids ain't right. I ain't realized till I got home and I started to edit this video to realize she cheated. She ain't even get a 15 pound. You know, I don't make her do the 30, but if she do, then that's fine with me. But I want her to hold the 15, you know, for the resistance. Man, she got a five pound weight. That's half the size of the cats. Is she crazy? But you know what? It is what it is. So right here, I call these right here. I call these. Uh, I call these weight walk weight walks. Because what you're doing is you're holding the uh, weights and you're walking. And we go right and then we come back and that's pretty much what it is. So these are pretty much weight walks. And the reason why I call them weight walks is because we're walking with 30 pound weights. Well, she's walking with 5 pounds. Look at this little video. Look like a little dumbbell, doughbell. Oh, she made me so mad. Oh, kids ain't right, boy. They just don't be right sometimes. What wrong with them? It's okay because we was all messed up when we was kids. You know what I'm saying? But... That's pretty much what was going on there. You want to see us come back with it, you know, and then that pretty much be the end of that. But we have fun at the gym. They have massage chairs. You know, you can go sit up in there. After we do our workouts for about 45 minutes, then we go sit in the massage chair for about 10 minutes. Then we walk back home because I walk almost two blocks to the gym and I walk back because I want that sweat. I want this weight off, sis. I'm trying to tell y'all. Look, I put in work. Literally, four t I put in work four or five times a week. Work, work. And that, there's no shortcuts with this. As you can see, there's no shortcuts. Either you, you do it or you don't. You know, and ain't no don'ts up in there. You do it, you do it, you do it. When I go there, I put in work. And then we get up out of there. We go there from, today we was there from, we started working out about 11. We got done working out about 1.10. And then we sat in the massage chef for 10 minutes. And then we got up out of that. That's because, you know, we take our time. Right here, it's me and my daughter. We lifting some weights. We do two sets of 10s. And then it's usually the last thing we do for the day after we've done other things. That's a couple of things I didn't film, you know, because sometimes I just be like, we're getting to start the damn camera, you know. But it is what it is. Um... I just be want to do my voiceover so I don't just upload a video with no sound and it be whack. Like, good quality by looking at the video, but like, where's the sound? You know what I'm saying? I just have a lot of energy, y'all. And before I take my shower, I just wanted to edit this up for y'all and relax because I got to do the same thing tomorrow. <laughs> Same thing tomorrow. It will be Happy Friday. It will be my last. Can somebody please tell me what this shower? What in the whip my hair back? Never man. I don't know what my daughter be doing sometimes. She's so fun and energetic. You think I'm energetic, baby? She have ten times more energy than me, and I got a lot of energy. 
And another thing, you know, since we've been on keto, the energy is just up there, as y'all can see. But, you know, this is our last set of 10 we're doing. But, you know, it's crazy. Some people think their kids can't be on keto. My daughter been on keto also for just about um, two weeks or so. So, you know, it's possible. You just got to know how to do it for them. But, you know, it is what it is. She's losing weight. She like it. She like going to the gym. And, hey. So, please like, share, comment, subscribe. Click that bell so you can get the notifications every time I drop a video. Whether it's a mukbang or it's a workout video, I appreciate everybody. Thanks for tuning in watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's your girl, Miss Crystal. I'm up out of here.